Hey guys, Buff Elgato here. I'm going to show you where the five Arabian horses are in Red Dead Redemption 2. Their locations, which horses they are, when and how to get them. A lot of people don't even know that there are five. So I want to go to the map real quick, show you exactly where. And one thing I suggest is it's okay to get a couple of these before you beat the main story. But I recommend that you beat the main story first because no spoilers, but when you beat the main story, the story will continue in the epilogue. But when you beat the main story, any horses that you have in your stable, they're going to be turned loose. So when you beat the story, your stable will be empty. And you're going to have to go back out and capture some of these horses. Now, there are three Arabian horses that I keep in my stable. You can only hold three in your stable. And there's two that are in the game that I don't bother capturing or anything like that. And I want to go over all of this with you. And I want to show you some of these horses. So there is the black Arabian horses. Now, these Arabian horses are smaller than most of the other horses, but they're very fast and agile. So the black Arabian horse can be found in the San Denis stable after chapter four. So after chapter four, you go here and you will be able to buy him. Okay. Now, I leave him there because he's always going to be there. I do not have him um, bought and in a stall in my stable because he's just always there. You can get him back, okay? Uh, if you sell him, if he gets killed, whatever, you can go back here and buy him, okay? So I'm not worried about him. Another one is the white Arabian horse. Now, the white Arabian horse, I did a video on it. You're going to get him right around in here, northwest of Lake Isabella. You're going to go up here and capture him. Now, the best way to do this is whenever you lasso the horse, uh, hold down the left trigger if you're playing on controller to hold on to the lasso and just keep tapping X to calm him down. Once you get close to him, you hit the Y button or triangle on PlayStation to mount him. When you do that, your left thumbstick hold down and then while you're holding down on the left thumbstick whichever way he moves push the opposite way and i just repeatedly mash x to calm him down and i'll show you and uh it's very simple in case you don't know in case you don't know most of you probably already know but this is where you get the white arabian horse now him he's out in the wild i do put him in the stable i captured him after i beat the game and i'm in the epilogue I go up here, I capture him, I put him in the stable. Now, one uh, that you can buy is down here in Blackwater. Now, you have to beat the game, and you have to be past Epilogue Chapter 1. After Epilogue Chapter 1, you go to Blackwater, and you go to the stable, and you can buy the Rose Gray Bay Arabian horse. A lot of people don't know about this one. The Rose Gray Bay uh, Arabian horse is in here. Now, I did not buy him, and then I did not put him into a stall because he will always be here for me. I'm only capturing the ones that are in the wild. Another one is the Red Chestnut Arabian horse. The Red Chestnut Arabian horse spawns around over here west of Awanhia. Lake is the red chestnut Arabian horse. I will show him um, to you guys. He is in my stall. He's over here. A lot of people don't know about him. You'll find him right around here. Just keep riding around over here, and you'll see him up in the mountains. The other one that's really rare, guys, that's really rare, is the warped brindle Arabian horse. Now, this was originally left out of consoles. They were, it was only released on PC for about a year or two. 
and not too long ago it came out to consoles but it is called the warped brindle you're going to go to the wapita indian reservation again do this after you beat the game and you're going to go right here on top of this mountain okay right behind them to the northwest you're going to go up here on top of this mountain it is very very rugged terrain it's hard to move around uh, but he is right up here on top of this mountain. He's probably the most beautiful Arabian horse, in my opinion. Um, make sure if you get him, put him in the stall. Anyway, guys, I'm going to show you some videos of me capturing these uh, horses and what they look like and their stats, things like that. All right. Okay, so here I'm at the stable, guys. And you want to see, here's the white Arabian. There's a chestnut and there's the warped brindle. And I'm going to show you on the map where I went exactly to get the warped brindle. I was very excited they included this in the console version. So here I am just northwest of the Wapita Indian Reservation. I'm just going to go up here on top of this mountain. It is really sketchy here. There's lots of cliffs and rocks and everything. Uh, I have a hell of a time. If you want to continue watching me uh, lasso and capture this horse, be my guest. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and cut off the commentary. So, guy, there he is right there. I'm just trying to study him and track him. Just want to try to get 100% on everything. But, guys, I hope this helped. If it did, please hit like. Please share. Thank you for watching. Uh, if you want to see more, please subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Now calm yourself. You don't, you don't need to do that. Ah, you're a jumpy one. Don't mean it. It's nothing, really. Not a big deal. Stay calm, friend. Hey, now. Hey, enough. Nuh-uh.